looking at such an amazing number of submissions. Architecture, interiors, landscape, fashion. So you walk into the room and there's a table full of portfolios. We vote, we put stickers next to the ones that rise to the top. You see the, the debates, you see even the oh, a little so, bit of the friction. It was so, so wonderful. Yeah, it's because passionate. everyone cares. Everyone cares right. about design. It's about the entire breadth of design. It's not about one discipline or one form of design. Fashion designer speaks very differently about architecture. A product designer speaks very differently about some graphic design. But at the same time, there's, there's ideas that connect them all together. The depth and, and lineage of experience on the jury is humbling, to say the least. Especially that we did receive uh, one of the awards. You realize, oh my god, all that went into picking us. That's true. <gasps> We all recognized when there was a clarity of concept, there was a commitment to create something innovative. Many of us take design extraordinarily seriously because it has such a, a dramatic impact in how people live their lives. Because it is the Smithsonian Institution, the bar is set very high. It's actually super interesting to me that it's in a museum because essentially what you're saying for the rest of time is that this exemplifies something good at this moment. The awards remind the entire country that design is important and design is part of your everyday life. And any particular award, you go back and look at its recipients over a decade or two and you go, oh, they got quite a few of them right. All the designers that we chose today have had an impact, not only on their own field, but also an amazing impact on the society.